Hi everyone! I wanted to let you know how you can use a spelling resource called Spelling City to help your second grader out with practicing their spelling words this year. So what you would need to do is either download the Spelling City app on your mobile device or you can go to spellingcity.com. And then from there you're going to need to search for the um, classroom teacher. So I'm going to go up here and click on search and then the teachers slash parents button. And once it comes up with the search bar, I'm just going to type in my name. So you guys would just need to type in Brittany Olson. And you'll come up with a few different choices. So you'll click on the one next to Bonner Elementary. And then this, um, on the side here, it lists the different spelling lists for the year, and they kind of go in backwards order, actually, so you're going to want to go down to the way bottom to start with. So we've already done the first three lists of the year, so this week we're on a walk in the desert, so you would click on that. And then you're going to have a lot of different options for how you want to practice the words. So you can do um, like a spelling test or you can have them teach you or play games and these are those words that we'll be working on for the week so if I click on play a game um, there's a lot of games to pick from but we just have the free version of spelling city for the second graders to access so I would just highlight the free over there or if you're on the app I think they only give you the options for the free games anyways and then any of these um, you could pick from. So um, I played the missing letter one with the class last week. And so you would just start up the game and figure out what letters needed to go into the word for that to be spelled correctly. So a fun resource to use, um, app is really easy to use too and very similar. You just need to search for the teacher and then click on the list and then whatever activity you want to do. So let me know if you have any questions and I hope that this will be a good resource for you.